I was I was excited to just be able to come back at all because I, I told the producers when we were filming uh, they have seven more years if they want me to play because I've been playing it for seven years and I think 14 year window for a vampire is about enough uh, and so just the idea that I could go back and play Spike was really exciting uh, the, the the idea that that Amber would be writing with Christopher Golden was freaking perfect because both of them know the world in and out. They're both hugely talented and so patient, which mm -hmm. is good for me because I can be annoying. Uh, and, and what? <laughs> and uh, and yeah, I just um, I forget. James, save me. Sure, um, <laughs> as always. Um, no, it's uh, yeah. To get to come back and play this, I don't know which camera to look at. Um, I'll look at all of them. Um, you know. Uh, it, how do we, what are we talking about? Um, no, it was incredibly exciting yeah. and to get to play in the world and to have the character so much more fleshed out and to get to do scenes um, with people I had never worked with, like yeah. Tony and Emma. Well, I worked with Emma, but, and Charisma, and those, like, watching those people work and everybody work has, was like, sometimes I was like, oh, crap, I have a line. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, it was incredible. And the thing is, is that we were originally really well cast. We, they, they cast very good actors in roles that they can really shine in. And so just it was, it was kind of getting back together and effortlessly, it, it was just fun. I'm sorry to say, it, it was, was so easy. And I remember listening to you and just being like, how is he dunking every line? Yeah. It's like, boom, boom, dunk. And, and I was like, oh, he's just... just He's just being himself. Like he's he's he is perfectly cast as Clint, and you combine your you have a warm personality, and you combine that with oh, the lines, and it's just, you get a great character. You know? yeah. Well, yeah. it's easy to dunk when you're being set up. <laughs> yeah. Well, okay. Yeah. 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 Here you go, buddy. <laughs>so much more like special effects kind of stuff to use the brain to that you couldn't budgetarily probably use before that's a good question um i, I guess i'll flip it because i i um i think that the scripts that we that were written probably would be easily film you know yes a little bit of money there yeah but that that, that they fit very much in what you'd expect out of out of an original episode um, uh, my concern was the fights. Uh, I thought I'd done other audible dramas, and the fights kind of sounded like this. Mm, ah, ee, ah. Like, and it, I'm like, cheesy is not the brand, you know. That the, I think the movie was kind of camp, and it, it, that's not the way to serve this kind of property. Um, and they were like, oh, don't worry about it. You know, we, we're a different company. We, we do it right, and don't worry about it. I was like, okay, now I'm worrying. Um, but then they, they, they had me hear it. I listened to about 15 minutes of it, and I was like, oh, my God. It's perfect. And the, 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 the technology that they're using is this proprietary technology that um, puts the audience in a specific point at, in the room and then blocks the actors digitally because we, were, we, we recorded it just standing still at a microphone, but they're manipulating, right? Yeah. And they're, they are moving our voices around the room, and they took the time to block all of the scenes for all of the episodes. And they showed me the notes, and they had me listen to it. And for, for those people who have surround sound, you will hear us walking around you. And they, they had me listen to it in stereo, too, and it's still very effective. But what, I had this idea that people should in their friend group, find the person who has surround sound and then have listen parties. <laughs> Not much. Yeah, I don't yeah. feel like it was a challenge. There was more of an almost freedom to it. Cause... Well, the thing is, James and I are theater actors. And so, like, when you're, when you're doing theater, your face is like this big. You know, and your eyes are pretty much invisible, so it's mostly... Speak for yourself. <laughs> well, your eyes are huge. I know. Yeah. And, but All it's... the better to look at you. Thank you. You're quick. So, so like, like, you're hanging words in the air. That's, that's kind of your job. And in a certain rhythm, in a certain color, to tell a story. And so, going, I guess, I guess knowing that you are doing that, 
because really when you when you're filming something, it is about covering up what you're feeling with your voice, covering the, trying to hide things because it's going to be seen anyway because the camera is so so intimate, and so it's it's really good film acting is is actually trying not to be seen, knowing you'll fail, <laughs> but but you don't want to try to communicate everything that you're feeling because that's that gets cheesy and then and so uh, it is it is a process of putting all of the information that you have about your character into the voice but for for, for us for us yeah. that was so close to what we do all the time anyway yeah so, yeah No, I've completely forgotten him. You know, I've left him way behind. You know. Oh, come on, buddy. No, I mean, you no, know, you people haven't. think I'm insane. You know. Well, sure. Go to a party. Hey, we James, don't like how to say doing? that word anymore. You know. Oh, I'm fine. You know. <laughs> can't do it. No, I've moved on with my life. I guess, yeah. <laughs> how do you forget that yeah. guy? Yeah, you, no. Couldn't no. if you tried. <laughs> and I've tried. <laughs> no, for me, the character was always sort of an extension of uh, my natural personality and just putting that into the lines and it, this was so because Chris and Amber know me really well we've been friends for a very very long time and they just put all of it they just were like here you go yep. and it was like yeah so it's kind of always been there yeah